You played center. Now you played. You played center field before. What's the toughest thing for you to do in sports? Catch a catch a football from Philip Rivers or or hit a fastball? Um, I say hit a curveball. Curve you know ball. that's. That's, that's a pretty tough day, you know. I, um, these guys come out here and do it every day. You know, a lot of people in the world can't do that. So that's a pretty tough thing. You mentioned that you, okay, center fielder, pitcher, and what else? Shortstop. Now, okay, what was your best position? Um, based on, you know, my size and ability, center field, but I actually love playing shortstop, but they told me I was too tall for it. Yes. How seriously did you did you think about pursuing baseball professionally? Well, um, I grew up loving baseball. It was my first love, so I always thought I would play baseball in, a, in the MLB. But you know, football came around, and I was pretty actually okay at it. So, you know, I got the opportunity to play in the NFL. Who was your favorite ball player, baseball player, growing up? My favorite base, Chipper Jones. Chipper Jones, man. He, he, he does it all. Lefty, righty. And, you know, he's just a great player. He's been playing for, forever, also. You Vincent Brown and Eddie Royal here at a podge the game to watch you throughout the first pitch. And any pressure there? Because if you bounce it, you're going to hear about it for, well, forever. Yeah, that's all I've been here. You know, everybody tell me not to skip it. So, you know, I'm, I'm going to stand on the mound, stand tall, and go, give him my best fastball. You know, hopefully they got the gun out and see what I can throw. i got to ask you how OTAs are going. First time under, under, under Mike McCoy. Now, I think it was Derek Cox. So the toughest thing for him is defending you and Malcolm Floyd. What's been the toughest thing for you so far? You know, just getting over. Derek Cox, he's a great, a great cornerback. And I, I love, he's a great addition to our team. So, you know, we're out there competing every day, you know, day in and day out, getting each other better. So it, it's, it's, it's been a great a great camp for us lately. You know, I'm looking forward to the future also. No one can question now your undeniable talent. How's the, it's all about staying healthy with you. How's, how's the health these days? Oh, uh, health is great. You know, I'm doing the right thing to stay on, on, top of my, on, my, on top of my health. And, you know, it's, 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 it just feels good to be able to go out and play every day, practice every day and get better and not have to worry about rehabbing and, you know, trying to get back on the field. So as long as I'm on the field, I'm happy and, you know, I want to make the best of it. Right, your two new teammates, that would be Dwight Freeney and Max Starks. Thoughts on the newest members of the Chargers? All right. We got better, you know, we got better with those two picks and, you know, our team, man, we got a, a very talented team. You know, if we can all stay healthy, it's going to be a big year for us. Ask you, you're talking about talented and right over there I see Eddie Royal and Vincent Brown. How excited are you about this wide receiver group that's coming in? Our, our wide receiver course is going to be great also. You know, we got not only those two guys, but you all, we also have, you know, Malcolm Floyd, who's been here for, what, nine years being productive. With our new draft pick, Kenny Allen. And, you know, these guys, we got a lot, a lot of guys, a, a lot of talent, you know. We can all stay healthy. We got some big things just coming this year. Would you remind Keenan Allen, San Diego Chargers and the Raiders are the bitter rival. Right, exactly. I mean, he knows now. You know, I'm pretty sure. You know, San Diego did let him know, so he, he, he he's learned his lesson. All right, thank you. Oh, he's a baseball player. He's he gonna get it there. He's gonna get it there. Wait, I think he's a football player. What do you mean he's a football hey, player? He's a baseball player, too. So, you know, we're gonna see. He's been juiced about it, though, you know. So, I think he'll do it. We got faith in him. Here's <laughs> Some pictures of the Padres. Four men come to the goal, man. Number 26. Birch Smith. Next, let's be our ceremonial first pitch on a read. This gentleman was one of the breakout stars in the NFL last season, scoring seven touchdowns in only ten games. Please welcome San Diego Chargers wide receiver, Demario Allen. 